Welcome back my children to another Harry Potter Hogwarts mystery video. So I am gonna finally continue the story. And um, I did get a new outfit from... What was it? The uh, the one where you, you make the potions. I, I forgot what it's called. But it's this one right here, the one I'm wearing. With the pants as well. And uh, there's... Um, specific hair it comes with, but I don't like it. I think it was this one. I kind of don't, don't remember. Either this one or this one. One of those, but I prefer the hat. And in, anyways, I just wanted to show it. It does look nice though, even though it has flowers on it, or roses, whatever they are. But it does look cool. Anyways, so I'm gonna continue with the story. So finally, gotta visit Rowan and see if he's dead or not. I'm hoping he is. But I have, I have a feeling he's not going to be dead. There he is. Oh. Did, he, did his voice get deeper? Because I remember it was, oh, now it's, oh. Anyways, uh, father, you came to visit my sick old bones. Cough, cough. That's so fake. I brought chocolate frogs, my star chart from astronomy class, and a book about Wendelian... Wendelin, Wendelin, I think, the weird, whoever that is. Oh, she's one of my favorite witches from the Middle Ages. Thanks, father. You're not welcome. How are you feeling? <laughs> Better, but not great. I think that cursed eyes, eyes did something to me. I f it felt like the longer we were in the corridor, the more the cold drained my strength. Good. We'll definitely dress warmly when we go back next time. <laughs> yeah, next time. He's obviously scared. Is something wrong? I think I'm just tired. Let's talk about what we, what you can do differently when you return to the cursed vault. Yep, he's scared. Talk with Rowan. Three hours, okay? So I now I have to talk with him. It's torture for him getting attacked from by the ice. Did something conjure you? Did someone conjure you flowers? Okay. Anything else I could click on other than him? I guess not. Anyways, talk. Do you, Do you want me to feed you? Do you want me to feed you? Wait, what? How does that make sense? He's the one in bed, and not me. Not me. Why would he want to feed me? Whatever. Offer help. Do you want me to to read to you? That was him talking to me, right? Asking me to feed me? Or was that me to him? Whatever. Read. You must you must get boring and it must get boring in the hospital wing. Watch. Do you feel alright? Talk. I am quite busy, Mr. Atkins. Talk. I don't feel so well. Observe. Don't worry, I'll catch you up on homework. Yeah, I don't care about homework. Ponder. Being here really puts the danger of magic in perspective. Offer help. Okay, so I need energy now. Do I have any videos to watch? Let me see. Yes, I do. So I'll be back. Alright, offer help. Thanks, father. Look. These flowers look beautiful. Okay, wonder. I'll watch another video. Wonder. I wonder when I'll I'll next end up in the hospital wing. Never. Okay, there should be one more video for me to watch to get more three more energy. It has to appear. There we go. So I'll watch it. There we go. And now I have to collect energy. So I'm going to do that quickly. So first Catspur, then these two right here. Okay, so I'm going to go to my dormitory. There's the little mouse. Um, what did I name him? Name him? I kind of forgot. Oh, Dice. I haven't changed his name yet. Maybe I should. Yeah, Dice. I'll do it another time. I just can't think of a name at the moment. Anyways, there's Dobby. 
um, the clubhouses now should give me hopefully some energy okay that, that one gave me some creature food how about chin's clubhouse awesome and energy and now for a hippogriff another energy great watch towers there's the energy I'm gonna go to magical creatures reserve there's the little dog and uh, I did send Billy Boat to a task he's finished now he got two stars so I'm getting 149 bonus creature affinity XP 9 creature food 30 hippogriff XP 2 gems 250 coins 4 to regular XP 7 energies and 20 empathy points so awesome a bunch of rewards and now I'm gonna feed them and for Bow Truckle I'm gonna bond with him as well he needs to do some bonding with me he's gonna level up right now so that's awesome nice I wanna get him maxed as well awesome he gave me 6 energy 150 coins and 5 gems very cool now to feed him for being a good little Bow Truckle gotta think what I'm gonna name him once I max him guess you can only name them once you max them all right I collected 20 chinks XP the fairies right here gotta feed her as well all right hopefully she gives me something nice let's see 200, 15, 15. I'll take the 200 coins. I do need some coins. I was very low on coins. Now I have 860. All right now for Sniffler and then Billy Boat. All right, give me something good. It would be nice if they gave me a thousand coins. That would be great. And uh, five, five. I'll take the 25 coins. It's bigger than five, of course. All right now for Billy Boat. Since he did go on a mission, hopefully he gives a bit of bigger reward. Let's see. 40, I'll take the 40 empathy. All right, thank you. Nice. And Sniffler, thanks. I'll sniff you later. Okay, so now I gotta send them, send one of them on an activity. Flying creature, that one is small creature, participate in creature hour. Story time with magical creatures. Small creature. Could be Sniffler, but I think I'll send Pinker Spell. I think she will work out better. Pinker Spell has arrived at Flourish and Blots. At the line, Jenkins is impressed by how well behaved Pinker Spell is around the customers at Flourish and Blots. Awesome. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to the burrow. I think the gnome is there. Yeah, there we go. So an energy from him. Then I think the little snitch. Yes, he's right there. Okay, since I have 25 out of 28, I'm going to continue with the story quickly. Hospital wing. Then I'll collect more, the rest of the energy I have left. So observe. I don't feel so well. Chat. Don't worry, I'll catch you up on homework. No, I won't. Ask question. Re recovery times are hard to predict. Observe. And that's it. That's the last star. You don't look that bad. I got a uh, chocolate frog and 50 coins, so oh. awesome. I hope you die, Roland. Aside from trusting warmly and learning incendio, I'm not sure there's there's much else you can do to prevent, to prepare for the cursed vault. I'm working on finding some warm clothes and learning that spell while you, while you recover. You should be ready to head back to the curse vault by the time I'm finished. Uh, I'm not going back. What do you mean? I want to help you, but 
I'll never be strong enough to help with the cursed vaults. That is correct. You are very right on that. I'm only holding you back. I need your help. You need to rest. Hmm. I need your help. I need your. You need to rest. If I tell him you need to rest, he's not gonna come. You see? Cause and. Cause if he doesn't go with me, there's a chance somebody else will go with me. Potentially one cent. Hopefully not Ben Ten, or I'm gonna kill myself. I need your help. No, you need to rest. Yes, stay there. I understand, Rowan. Just get your rest and I'll work out a way to get inside the cursed vault. Yes, awesome. <laughs> Thanks for understanding, Father. It's just that confronting that door was the closest I've ever come to dying. And you should have. Send an owl when Madame Pomfrey says you're strong enough to help leave the hospital wing for good. It's time for fi flying class. But I'll keep doing what I can to pre prepare for another trip to the cursed vault. Good riddance. Alright, so finished with that. What's next? Attention, flying class is beginning on the training grounds. Do not be late. Um, you're not the boss of me. I'll be late whenever. As much as I want to be. I'll go there whenever I want. Chocolate frogs. I got three. Three energy from it. Okay, so I'm going to collect the rest of the energy first. I'll go to lower floor east. There's the pages and the books. Now for the castle, castle grunge, should have the stick. Yeah, there it is. Uh, east towers should have the portrait <laughs> and a pet peeve. Then uh, dungeons, I already did Dobby. Now for a duel. So let's see, who do I duel? It's gonna be Eduardo. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep choosing Sneaky. There we go. What is that? Oh damn, 15 damage. Okay, I'm gonna try to stun him. Hopefully it works. Come on. Awesome, I stunned him. Alright. No, I meant to do a uh, flipendo. Whatever. Doesn't matter, I guess. Alright, he's stunned. He can attack. Alright, now I'm gonna use flipendo. Time to defeat the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. But I'm gonna kill the rainbow. And there we go. Awesome. So got an, an, er, an energy from defeating him. Cool. Now I have to earn stars to complete the daily stamp. Yeah, earn six stars from anywhere. Well, the daily planner, whatever. Anyways, the next one is Lower Floor West. I collected the, the energy already, but I'm gonna do the uh, Play Gobstones. And then have a meal with a friend. So I'm gonna go with one cent. Perhaps we can get in some potions practice while we improve our gob skills. Gobstone skills. What do you say, father? Sure. What potion disguises you? Polyjuice Potion. Of course, that's correct. And I got a bonus of two. Would you join a potions club? Absolutely. I'm not gonna get a bonus from that since uh, it's not higher than uh, the required points. Sounds like you've been paying attention in potions class. I wish I was doing as well at gobstones. That's what we're practicing, isn't it? Go on, ask me that another. Which potion relieves a cold? Oh damn, I actually forgot. Hit coughing solution. Invulgaration draw. Okay, I don't know this one. 
I think it's like one of the first times it comes up this question. I'm searching it up just because I don't want it. I don't want to get it wrong. Cops are there. We go. I still have to tab opened. Uh, which potion relieves the cold? Pepper up potion. Okay, I would have gotten it wrong because I was gonna choose the one of the other two. So I'm glad I searched that up. All right. I I had no idea you were such a dab hand at copstone water. I'm sorry I can't offer more more of a challenge. Nonsense. I could use the practice. Besides, the potions review is always helpful. All right, one more, I guess. What potion makes you lucky? Uh, Felix Felicis. And there, I'm done. What you gonna say? You didn't take a wit sharpening potion before this, did you? You're as clever at potions as you are at gobstones. At gobstones. Oh, awesome. So there, very close to, um, what you call it? Completing the uh, oh, the cast spells. I totally forgot about it. There's like two hours and one minute left. So it's at a great hall. Okay. That's the last one. I did the other two last night. And I was missing one, I just forgot about it. Oh my goodness, this stupid girl again. I hate you. Why are you always here? Bend over, freaking bend your knees. Is that is it really that hard? Did nobody teach you how to pick up books or whatever? Anything that falls on the ground? Nobody taught you that? Damn, you have some disappointing parents. And now she's gonna act like they just flew on through her hands. She's like, whoa, I just stirred long enough for them to come to me. Stupid girl, I hate her. Very much. Alright, which is the next one? Oh, I think I saw it. Yep, the little cup that has a mouse tail. So now it's gonna turn into a mouse, and they're gonna look at it like they did not expect to have a mouse. They're like, very surprised to see a mouse. Alright, what's next? Oh, okay, I see it. It's all the way over there. The little uh, pixie fairy, whatever it is. So gotta use Flipendo on it. Just send it into the cage. I don't know who it's mocking. There's nobody in front of it. Or whatever. There we go, that's it. And now to go to Rowan. Since she's the one who sent me to do that. The spells and whatnot. Wow, what magic. If Professor Flitwick could have seen us, he'd have been so proud. Speaking of which, let's not mention all that to Professor Flitwick. Will be our little secret. I'ma tell on you and I'ma make sure he expels you. Alright, 24 energies. Also, I forgot in Hippogriff Clubhouse, I'm able to do the Hippogriff quiz with one cent, so I'm gonna do that quickly. The good thing is that I got a bunch of coins to be able to do these. I'm writing a bon botanical quiz for incoming Hippogriff Club members. Care to help me test its difficulty? When do roses bloom? six to eight weeks. I have these answers engraved in my brain. So it's quite easy for me. Unless I haven't seen one of the questions before. What plant is kelp related to seaweed? Awesome. I don't even have to look at the questions, I just know the answer. I want to make sure that this quiz isn't too easy or too hard. It has to be just right. <laughs> Keep questioning me one cent. I'm sure we'll figure out the right difficulty. How should a hellebore feel? Tough and loud, leathery. There we go. And a plus four. Alright, let's look. Looks like we're getting to the end of the quiz. Only a few more things to ask. I'm up to the challenge. Let's keep going one cent. 
when should I plant ginger root? Early spring. And that is it. I got all the diamonds. You really know your vegetation, father. I can't wait to share this quiz with other Hippogriff club members. Alright. Now what? Now I have 24 out of 28. I don't think I got energy from that, did I? Alright, now for the last one. Do a meal with a friend. This time... Yeah, actually I wanna see what I get. And no, it's not gonna increase it, actually. I'll go with Ben 10, just because. Contrary oh. to purpose, I believe. I'm not afraid of everything. That's my favorite things, father. What's my favorite drink? Butterbeer. Because you literal was. Then again, it's probably. It probably tastes good. Good work, father. I must talk about what I'm not afraid of. I didn't get to read all of it. Damn it. I, I clicked by accident. Whatever. Who's my favorite classmate? Me. Because I'm better than everyone. And he agrees. Ooh, and a plus six. Cool. I'm impressed, Father. You might know more things I'm not afraid of than I do. This is not fun. I'll try to guess some more. Just to get this over with. What's my favorite holiday? Halloween. Which, it should be Easter. It just makes so much sense for him to to prefer Easter over Christmas. Because he's a wimp. Nice work, Father. It's nice talking about the things I actually like. Yeah, I, I don't want to hear about it. I don't care. Alright, finally done with him. Alright, now I'm gonna go to the flying class. Oh, also now that I think about it, I have to do the lesson. Strengthening solution. Ah, whatever. I'll go with this one. Attend flying class. Okay, there's people commenting. Two of them. Madam Hooch. Buy your broom. Buy your broom. Class is about to begin. Okay, now I understand what it's trying to say. Alright, one cent. The rumors about Ben, ben 10 just keep getting stranger. Okay, I don't see... Oh, the Rowan is there. Why? Isn't he supposed to be at the hospital? Dying? Um, and then Benton is not here, so even better. But there's Marula. Why her? They say your little friend, Kana, ended up in the hospital wing trying to help you find a cursed vault. Don't pretend that you care about my friends, Marula. He's not my friend, but okay. Oh, I don't care about you or your friends, but I do care about the cursed vault. Though uh, not as much as your brother. Also, Rowan is literally behind her. I don't get it. Whatever. Why do you think he was so obsessed with the vaults? Treasure, knowledge, does challenge. Hmm. Treasure, knowledge, the challenge. Not too sure. The challenge? Hmm. The treasure, maybe? What do I prefer? I prefer both the challenge and the treasure. Maybe the treasure, yeah, let's go. There are rumors that the vaults are filled with gold prophecies and artifacts. I assume he wanted, all, wanted it all for himself. I know what happened to him. You know what happened to my brother? You have to tell me. <laughs> Later, Atkins. Class is about to begin. Yeah, I don't care. No Flying worries. is not unlike walking. Flying it's class. One hour. Okay. Prepare to summon broom. Hmm. Hmm. It's time to practice summoning your brooms. Stand up, hold out your right hand, and say up. Okay, watch. Madam Hooch is the Quidditch referee. Yeah, nobody cares. Who was... Oh, wow. I don't even get to read it. Um, A gem or 15 empathy? I'll go with a gem. Okay. 
Now, Mr. Atkins, let's see you summon your broom. So all I have to do is swipe up and there. That was very easy. If somebody fails that, they're pathetic. Okay, what's next? Review of basics. Hmm. Take time to familiarize. Oh, great, I clicked by accident. Anyways, balance. Why is it so hard to balance on this broom when I do everything else perfectly? Yeah, you don't do anything perfectly. Concentrate. Focus on has never been my strong suit. I don't think anything is your strong suit. Grip the broom. I hope I don't get a splinter. I hope you do. Gossip. I heard it. I heard the whole something. I don't know. Um, 25 coins. <clears throat> Since I'm running out of coins. I'm ready to fly away. Off I go. So here we go. Isn't Rowan supposed to be at the hospital wing? I don't get it. Whatever. Also, it's kind of um, weird how they're just standing there looking at me flying. When they could be do doing something else. Broom carry maintenance. Hmm. A well of maintenance broom is a fast broom. To, to your broom care stations. Okay, listen. We should have a race around the castle. Listen. It would be a shame if you fell off your broom and landed broom and landed in the Blake Lake. Okay. Use no. Oh, I didn't want you to do that. Okay, whatever. Use. Hey, let go of that. I think that's what she said. Um, another twenty-five coins. A nice coat of polish will make a big improvement. Okay. So now to polish my broom. And make it a Polish broom. Oh wow, that was it. Didn't really seem like a a Polish. Socialize. Why? Well, well, if it isn't someone else, so everyone's least favorite cursed student. Who, me? Ignore. This old broom needs a lot of work. Listen, it will be a shame. Oh my goodness, I didn't even get to read it. Ooh, a book. I'll take that. Uh, I don't like her. Hi, you think you're so smart, but but I bet you don't know this. Answer question. Who has, who has been to every Quidditch World Cup since they were born? Marula will... Uh, one cent and roll one. How am I supposed to know that? Okay, I'm gonna search for the answer because I don't want to get it wrong. Okay, so... Who... Has been... Who has been... To every... Quit... Ditch... World Cup since they were born. And the answer is... Marula claimed to have attended every Quidditch Stadium. Quidditch World Cup since she was born. Okay, so I guess Marula. Yep, awesome. At least I got it right. She claims, but it doesn't mean it's true. <laughs> She's angry because I got it right. Awesome. Prepare to mount a broom. Hmm. The time has come to climb ab aboard your broom, stay focused and uninjured. Okay. Stretch fingers. Ha! I love how she hits herself. Hope you enjoyed the view, view of my broom bristles. Daydream. One day I'm going to buy myself a proper racing broom. Well, eyes. Concentrate. It's hard to con concentrate. I didn't get to read all of it. Um, 
Damn, there's 10, there's 50. I'll go with 10 courage. It's time to climb onto my broom without falling. I have to focus. And there, that was very easy. And Marilla keeps hitting herself because she's stupid. She deserves it, to be honest. Okay. Well done. There we go, I finished. So I got four, five, six, twelve um, courage points and three um, house points. Tell me what you know about my brother. I will, as long as you do something for me. What do you want? It's unlikely given your ineptitude, I think, but promise to tell me if you ever open a cursed vault. Hmm. Promise to tell me if you ever open a cursed vault. I won't promise, I promise. Why do I have to? I wish there was an option where it said fake the promise, but it just says promise or I won't promise. I do want her to tell me if she knows anything about the brother. Hmm. Yeah, I don't like her. I won't promise. I'm not promising you anything. You're probably buying about. And knowing anything about my brother anyway. Fair enough. If you change your mind, I'll tell you everything I know as soon as you tell me that you... What you find in the cursed vaults. <laughs> you better hurry, Atkins. From what I've heard, your brother won't survive much longer. Oh, nice. The data planner is complete. So I got 6 energies, 50 coins, 3 gems, and 200. I'm not too sure what that is. It doesn't really sh show what it is. But I'm assuming... Oh wow, I have to wait three hours. Meet Rowan. Madam Pom... Madam Pomfrey says that I... That since I survived flying class, I can leave the hospital wing. Now I need decent food. See you at dinner. Great. Whatever. What I was gonna do? Um, I think it's dragon points. The 200 I got, I'm not quite sure. Doesn't really say what it is, but whatever, I guess. Full marks. Alright. Oh, nice, I completed some of them. I'll collect them quickly. There we go. Nice, a double. Now a number one. Awesome. I would like to get the number one reward. Hopefully, I'm able to. Do I have enough coins? No, I don't. I wanna. Get the increased boost. But anyways, um, creature food. So I have to wait three hours to meet Rowan, which is kind of annoying. I'm gonna go for strengthening solutions. What I was planning to do was, I was gonna end up purchasing the magical milestone sweetheart style. Since I got all the rewards, the free ones, so all I need to do is purchase the premium rewards and get all of them. But I can't really do that since um, I have to wait three hours. I would do the strengthening solution, but I don't have enough energy and I don't, I don't want to buy the, uh, the milestones at the moment. The premium, premium rewards, basically. So I guess I'll wait three hours and come back. Yeah, I'll do that. So that I could continue with the video. I was hoping to just have it, have the whole video in one video. But I guess I'll have to combine two videos. It's whatever. Do you have anything else I need to do? Not really. I'll watch the videos after I stop recording. But yeah, I guess I'll come back later within three hours
Okay, it's been three hours and now to continue with the story mode. So meet Rowan. Alright. Oh, in the Great Hall? I thought it was gonna be the hospital wing. Anyways. Let's see what I have to do with him now. There he is. Are you feeling better, Rowan? Much better, though I do do get a terrible chill every now and, and again. You still seem sort of down. I hope you don't think I'm upset about you not wanting to return to the cursed vault. I just wish I was stronger and I hadn't and hadn't been so eager to explore that icy corridor. I should sure never have put you in danger. Actually, I should. I want to help you, but I feel like I'm useless, and you are. Let me see if I can help you feel better. Then we'll see how you can help me with the cursed bolts. Okay. So, recruiting Rowan. Why him? Why can't I beat somebody else? Start. I want to help you with the vaults, but I'm just not strong enough. Okay. I wish I was stronger. You'll get more powerful. Powerful. You have your own talents. Maybe if you studied more. Um. Damn, I'm not sure. I need three diamonds. Hmm. You have your own talents. You'll get more powerful. Maybe if you studied more. I feel like that's the right answer. Maybe if you studied more, since he loves studying so much. All right, let me choose it. Hopefully, I'm not wrong. Oh, come on! Damn it! I knew it was. You have your own talents. I just thought it was gonna be the studied one. Oh, but I got a plus eight. Was it eighteen? I think. Since I have nineteen, and the requirements was ten, ten, ten for each, so I get a good bonus. How can I help? I'll let you know your knowledge of Hogwarts by being an expert flyer. Yeah, there we go. Your knowledge of Hogwarts. I knew it. <coughs> that one was much easier. So, plus 10, plus 18 bonus. Ah. Awesome. You always make me feel better about myself, but I don't think I can help with the vaults. I understand, Rowan. Let's talk about all of the ways you can help. You're useless. You cannot help. I just have to make you think you can. I want to help with the vaults. I know you do. I never need any help. Yes, I want to choose that, but I don't want to get it wrong. Your knowledge is a big help. Hmm. Yeah, I'm assuming that's the right answer. Yep, I know it. Seems like the right answer, of course. I did want to say I never need any help, but whatever. Thanks, father. There are other ways I can help you with the vault. Yeah, whatever. Keep telling yourself that. Oh nice, I'm gonna level him up. Cool. Nice, I got 10 energy plus 1 chocolate frog. Ah. So I have, I should have 38 energy now. Thanks for making me feel better, father. I might not be able to... I might not be the strongest, but there are other ways I can help. I'll definitely need your help to work out a plan for getting into the cursed vault. I don't think I'm strong enough to get past the door myself. Lucky for you, I've spent countless hours alone in my room making multiple lists of the most powerful students at Hogwarts. Loser. Do you think there's someone who can help? One cent. Ben 10, ben 10 is the obvious answer because he's powerful and charms, but he won't be feeling up to something like this for a long time. Why Ben 10? Marula is powerful, but you obviously can't trust her. True. And I don't think she's really powerful, to be honest. You'll have to ask someone you've never even met. Someone even more powerful than Ben 10 and Marula. Maybe even more powerful than you. Who? <laughs> Bill Weas Weasley. He's strong? Well, I mean, I guess he is a Weasley, but... It would have been better if he said Ron Weasley. Never heard of him. <laughs> even though there's uh, other videos with him in the uh, in the game but that's those are events though so it makes sense you've never heard of bill weasley he's one of the most powerful boys in school <laughs> why not just say wizards he's one of the most powerful wizards in this year 
He's sure to be a perfect and head boy, and everyone says he's one of the bravest students at Hogwarts. He does sound like the perfect person to help with the cursed vault. The question is, how will you get a fourth year you don't know to help with a cursed vault? Yo, I'm not gonna bring a gift. I'll talk to him. I'll send an owl. Hmm. Yes, <laughs> I'll send an owl. I don't even have an owl. Um, obviously not a gift. That's a little too weird. Him being a guy, of course. I'll send an owl. I'll talk to him. I'll confront him and punch him. I'll just walk up and ask him. The worst thing he can do is say no. He's usually practicing defense spells on the training grounds. <laughs> Good luck, father. If Bill, Weas Bill Weasley becomes your friend, he'll sort of have to become my friend. <laughs> he wants more friends. Because he's lonely. Oh, okay. So that's for for the uh, chapter 6, I'm assuming. Now I have to do the lessons. Chocolate frogs. Cool. Nice. Extra card. So I went to 38 and 39, 40. Okay, that makes sense. So strengthening solution. That's the last thing I have to do for this uh, chapter. I'm assuming. Let us begin. Strengthening solution. No comments? I guess not. Wait, what is this? Oh, okay, since I leveled him up. Okay. Once I get him to level 10 is when I get unlock those glasses he has. But whatever. Anyways. So three hours. Let's see. Search for salamander blood. Today you will learn to brew strengthening solution. The lesson starts. We have to gather the ingredients for strengthening solution. Let's do it together. Yeah, I don't care. Okay, look about. I can only imagine what potions remain to be invented. Check closely. Once I brew strengthening solution, I'll rearrange the furniture in the dormitory. Whisper. This jar is sticky. <laughs> so stupid. Anyways, check the bottles. Bats, beetles, belladonna, belladonna, I believe. Rummage. Nope, nope, nope. I'm not sure what that was, but okay. Examine. The stuff in... Oh, wow, I didn't get to read it. Ooh, a thousand coins. Awesome. Some some jars are back there, but I can't tell if it's Griffin Claw. Cast Lumos to shine a light. Can't you cast Lumos yourself? You're a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry. Anyways. There's Lumos. Now we can see better. Well, he can see better, I guess. Prepare to crush Griffin Claw. You must cross crush the Griffin Claw with a mortar and pestle. Get to work. All right. So inspect. It looks like th these were sculpted by hand. Sort. I'm going to keep all the ingredients I need to crush together. Glance. I just saw something moving in there. Let's see. Grab for five, and this one read. This receipt recipe. Oh my goodness! Never mind. I didn't get to read it. Fifteen courage. Everything is ready. Now to crush the Griffin Claw. So let's see. How do I crush it? Okay, that's it. Awesome. So he's crushing it, or I'm crushing it, I guess. Very nice. Ah. Pour salamander blood slowly into your strengthening solution. Alright, listen. I'm going to be sore tomorrow. From what? You're not even doing anything heavy. Collect. I have everything I need. Listen. Inspect. Everything seems to be in order. Then that's five. Okay, I'll listen. 
Snip. Wow, never mind. I got the star. Uh, 10 empathy. I need to... I need to put my salamander blood in the cauldron. Cauldron. Alright, so... I'm gonna put it inside. And... It explodes? No. I don't like when he smiles like that. Very disturbing. Alright. Now for the next star. Prepare to stir. Now you must stir your strengthening solution forcefully. Alright. Ask for help. I know how to help. Yeah, I don't care about your help. Watch. After I drink this potion, you better watch your back. Yeah, whatever. Um, okay, gri tighten grip. I need to stir uh, vigorously. I think that's how you say it. Sprinkle substance. Careful. Oh, wow. I didn't get to read it. But I did see it said careful Ekin something. Um, 15 courage. I need to stir my strengthening solution. It requires quite an arm workout. Stir potion. Does it really? Whatever. There we go. So now he's stirring. And my glove is glitching. Oh my goodness, this stupid smile again. The good thing is that he has sunglasses, so I am not able to see his eyes. And his doofy smile or eyes whatever prepare to finish potion finish your strength solution quickly now is not the time to show weakness all right discuss oh i don't have energies left i'm gonna quickly check if i could collect any energy around cat spur is still awake let's see anything here yes so an energy from the snow globe and now a gem from the chest board. Um, let me see. Oh wow, pet peeve is not there yet. I cannot feed my creatures yet. I think West Tower should have it ready. Yes, the orange is ready. Awesome. How about the books? No, not yet. Maybe the stick is there? Nope. How about one of these energies here? Nope, nothing. Alright, so what I'm gonna do now... Wait, what is this? Oh, I get to claim free coins. Awesome. Okay. Um. Ooh, I forgot about the full marks. I got 10 right there. Am I still in first place? Awesome, I am. Good. I definitely want to increase the the uh, boost. There we go. 1.5. Cool. Do I have enough? No. Alright, so what I was going to do, uh, I'm going to purchase the Magical Milestone uh, Premium Rewards. So not those, the 4 dollars one. There, I bought them. Premium Rewards unlocked. So I got a bunch of stuff, including energy and coins, and a bunch of books. So, energy, book, coins, book, um, gems, book, toffee, book, brown book, red book, brown book, red book, energies, brown books, red books, coins, red books, gems, brown, red, brown, red, Okay, I'm not gonna name all of them. So far I have 208 energies. Nice. A lot of books. Now 218 energy. And now for the outfit. It doesn't look that great. I don't like the outfit this time too much. Let's look at it. So let's see. It's this pink shirt. Looks 
wacky. I don't like it. And this hair. Yeah. He looks like a loser. I'm not gonna wear that. I'm gonna just discard the changes. Nice, I have 218 out of 28. And what else? Okay. So now, I also have a bunch of coins now. I could get the times two boost. Hmm, should I do that? No, I'll save up my coins to be honest. All right, so what I'm gonna do now. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to finish this. Oh, and I have a bunch of chocolate frogs as well. Totally forgot. Hopefully I get one new one. Ooh, bonus cards. Oh, okay. At least one new one. That would be actually very nice. All right, so I had 218 energies. So I have to have more than 218. Awesome, 254. Cool. Unfortunately, I did not get a new one at all. Anyways, discuss. Our potions are slightly different shades. Do you think mine is off? Yes, because you suck. Asses. What? Asses? Or asses? Isn't it supposed to have two C's? Asses? What? Why did... It literally said asses. Like, you know... A-S-S, not. Isn't it put... I don't know. I didn't even read it because it caught me off guard. That was so weird. Anyways, pick up. Focus on your strengthening solution, Mr. Atkins. Ask for help. You want my help? You... Oh, wow, I didn't get you to read it. I forgot to turn off my timer. Whatever. Anyways, um... 50 coins. Might as well get more coins. I'm nearly finished. Time to add the final touches to my striding solution. Alright. Also, if I remember, the timer was for... for um, this game. Because I put a timer for when the... the... Um, uh, I was able to continue with the story mode. But I forgot to turn it off. But yeah, whatever. Alright, so... I learned the strangling solution. I got a chocolate frog, 25 knowledge, and 5 house points. There! Chapter 5 complete. Rowan's recovery. I got 200 coins and 400 regular XP. Nice. Chapter 6. Bill Weasley. The curse that seals the vault is some of the most powerful magic you've ever seen. But a skilled older student like Bill Weasley may be able to assist you. Why not Ron? Talk to Bill. Go to the training grounds and talk to Bill Weasley. Convince him to help us with the cursed vault. Yeah, whatever. What is this? Potions. Strengthening solution. Oh, cool. So it's... I could... Can I use it in dueling? Yeah, I don't think I can. I know uh, the Winging Weld potion I can, the other ones I can't, but yeah, whatever. I'm still in year two. Not sure how many more chapters there are. Oh, okay, it shows right here. So I'm, I'm on the sixth one, then there's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Cool, that's quite a bit. Anyways, I'm gonna go to Bill. Oh, right, I have another chocolate frog. New adventure. Are you serious? Lone Wolf. While investigating a werewolf attack, you work to gain Chirias Trust. Chiros Trust? Chirias Trust? Chirios Trust. I'll call her that or him, whoever that is. Chirios Trust. Prove that she can... Oh yeah, it's a, it's a girl. Prove that she can rely on you to earn her, earn her a, as a friend. Meet her. Remus Lupin. Oh, Remus Lupin, isn't that the, um, the old, the guy, that man that could turn into a wolf, I believe, and receive a special gift. The reward is, um, a wolf, I'm assuming? I don't know. 
So cool. Investigate the rumors. Come to the courtyard. There is a rumor you need to hear right away. Shut up, Betten. Damn, so now I have to do the the um event. Great. And I wanted to continue with the story mode. Oh, so it's it is the girl. Wait, so she's my reward? What? Is it the I get that girl as my reward? I don't get it. I'll have to find out, I guess. Yeah, it doesn't really show. But whatever. Part 1, 2, and 3 give me gems, and then part 4 gives me the girl. I'm assuming. I don't know. There's five tasks for, for uh, part 1. Alright. So I guess I'm gonna use all the energy for the event. And I'll continue the story mode another time. Yeah. Whatever. I guess it's because I... I got into chapter 6, so now I unlocked this event. But it's whatever, I guess. Anyways. Investigate, investigate rumors. Meet Hagrid. Play Cobstones. Wait, wasn't I supposed to do... Uh, the story mode in the courtyard? Oh, training grounds. Never mind. Yeah, I'm gonna con continue with the event. I'm not gonna continue the story mode anymore for now until I finish the event of course all right so there's six comment I mean three comments I'll start with this one fourth year I tripped down four flights of stairs today talk about embarrassing because you're an embarrassment all right Marula did you start the rumor that my hair is a wig I mean it does look like a wig to be honest Sixth year. Rumors at Hogwarts spread faster than Dragon Pox. Alright, so Benton. Do I want to know what all the commotion out here is about? That depends. How do you feel about rumors? I don't pay attention. I can't get enough. I start them. Hmm. I can't get enough. I don't pay attention. I honestly don't pay attention. But it will be a evil thing to say that I start them. So I'm going to say that. I start them. More often than not, I'm the one starting rumors. Remind me not to tell you anything embarrassing. <laughs> Still, I thought you're behind this latest rumor. If it's the one about Snape going blonde, then sadly no, I can't take credit for that. Good to know, but that's not it. This rumor I'm talking about is far more serious. <laughs> the way he, he went, oh! That was funny. There's been a werewolf attack at Hogwarts. It's all anyone can talk about, no matter how much you ask them to stop because it, because it frightens you. Wimp. <clears throat> a werewolf attack? What happened? Who was hurt? When was it? That's all I know, I'm afraid. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually very funny. Oh, I meant that literally, by the way. That's the only thing I know, and I'm already afraid. That isn't much to go on, but Hogwarts might be in danger. We better ask around and see if we can find out any more information about the attack. Also, why does Benton have to be here? I don't like him. Ask around. One hour, okay? Let's see, who can I ask? Is one cent around here? Uh, doesn't seem like it. Anyways, chat. I hope the last, the last who was attacked didn't get bit. Consider. Apparently some last was attacked by a werewolf in the Forbidden Forest. Inquire. I'm not going to jump to conclusions, but this werewolf thing, about this werewolf thing, okay? Think. Could these werewolf worm rumors be true? Uh, who else can I click on? Okay, this girl. Note. There was a werewolf attack in the Forbidden Forest last full moon. Check in. Yeah, I don't care about him. Follow up. 
I think my roommate might be the werewolf. He is awfully hairy. Oh, wow. Pay attention. I saw a girl who had been hurt being uh, led out of the... What? Okay, I didn't read it properly. Whatever. Um, great. I have to click on either Marula or Ben 10. I guess I'll go with Ben 10. Everyone keeps trying to guess who the werewolf might be. Okay, again. Ben 10. Listen. Oh, that's the last star. Nice. There's no way it's true that the werewolf is one of the professors, right? Alright, so 25 coins. Cool. So a girl was attacked by a werewolf in the Forbidden Forest during the last full moon. <laughs> oh. As if I needed another reason to never go outside again. But how could this have happened? It's possible this could somehow be related to the cursed vaults. Oh. Just when I thought they couldn't get any more dangerous. But rumors can only tell me so much. I'll need to investigate further if I want to find out who the werewolf is and why the attack happened. And the best place to f start is probably the question, probably to question the girl who was attacked directly. How? No one could actually give us a name. They couldn't, but one cent might be able to. She knows just about everyone at Hogwarts. Good thinking. I'll ask one cent during flying class if she knows who was attacked. You do that, father. I think I'll go and drink coca. Coco. Is it coca or coca? Coca and try to try to forget all about werewolves. Whatever. Investigate the rumors done. Ask one cent. If you want to if you want to ask me something before class starts, you better hurry to the training grounds. Okay, so I'm going. Ask one cent, talk to Bill. Obviously I'm not gonna do that, so ask one cent. Okay, let's see. Who's this? Is that Rowan? Yes. I must admit, I don't know how too much about the properties of Broomwood. Yeah, I don't care. Madam Hooch. Class will be beginning shortly. And who's that? Hufflepuff student. Werewolves can't fly, right? Um, maybe they can. So there's one cent. You wanted to ask me something, father? Yes, about a rumor. No, Snape's not actually going blonde. <laughs> That's good to know, but... Quiet down now, class. We're practicing a difficult flying maneuver today. <clears throat> You'll need to pay close attention before you get, you get on your brooms. Can this wait farther? Class is starting. This will only take a minute. It's, it, it's important. I want to know if you knew anything about the rumor that a girl was attacked by a werewolf. Are you sure you don't want to talk about a different rumor? This is important. Hogwarts might be in danger. I suspect this attack might somehow be related to the cursed vaults. But to be sure, I need to figure out who the werewolf is, where they might be hiding, and why they attacked. Ahem. She's glaring at me. Okay. Is there anything I can do to help? Actually, yes. I was hoping you might know the name of the girl who was attacked. Sorry, I'm afraid I can't. I don't. <clears throat> but you know, Father, you're only—you're not the only person who's been asking about the attack. Really? Who else has? Mr. Atkins, Miss Haywood. That's quite enough chatter. But you two can talk all you want after class. Until then, I want your full attention on your flying. And the only talk I want you to hear is watch out. Okay, so I guess I have to do the class. Yep, attend flying class. Three hours. Oh, cool. They're all, we're all flying. That's actually pretty nice. Is Marula there? No. Awesome. Lament. Why is, why is it that, why is it you always get caught talking when you don't, oh my goodness, I didn't get to read all of it. I kind of got stuck at the beginning. You could be looking into the werewolf attack beside, besides me. 
Oh, who could be looking? Okay. Listen. If you don't want to end up polishing brooms all day, I'd keep quiet. Uh, whoops. Let me do that. Consider. Should I get one cent to sign me the name of whoever's investigating the attack? Fly broom. I've never been so uneager to fly. Notice. One sense keeps looking at me. Is that supposed to mean something? Uh, that she's interested in me? Hufflepuff student. Shh. Hooch is scarier than a chimera when she's angry. Wonder. Who, whoever's also investigating the tech know the victim's name? Cheer. <clears throat> I think I'm finally getting the hang of this. Lament. Why is it always... Why is it you always get caught talking when you... Oh my goodness. Why do I keep stuttering there? Whatever. Think. Who could be looking into the werewolf attack besides me? Listen. If you don't want to end up polishing brooms all day, I, I'll keep, I'd i keep quiet. Flying broom. I've never been so uneager to fly. Okay, he said that already. Consider. Should I? Yeah, whatever. Note. I encourage you to keep your head in the clouds. Heed. Loose lips results in loose grips. Whisper. Oh, that's it? Awesome. Shh, Camara is scarier than a Camara when she's angry. Alright, so I got 50 coins and a chocolate frog. So let's see. Now we're free to talk. Now that class, class has been dismissed, we can talk. You mentioned someone else was investigating the werewolf attack. One cent? Yes, um, Charia, Chirio? Lobo, Loboska? Chirio Loboska. Who? Chirio Loboska, the one who created a cereal. Yeah, I'm just kidding. She's a Hufflepuff in our year, you know? The one with the silver hair. She's really nice. I've never... I've ever... What? I've ever... Oh, never, I'm reading it as ever. It's even. I've even seen her tutor one of the younger kids. Do you think um, Cheerio might know who was attacked by the werewolf? It's possible. She doesn't usually get involved in gossip, but she seems very interested in this rumor. And it sounds like I should pay Cheerios a visit. Before you do that, you should know that Cheerio hasn't been acting like herself lately. She's oddly reserved and quiet, and has been spending, spending most of her time alone. We were supposed to read to we were supposed to read to Lonely Ghost this week, but she didn't show up. To be honest, I'm a little worried. Don't worry, one cent. I'll be sure to check in on Cheerio when I ask her about the werewolf attack. Alright. So ask one sentence done. Convince Cheerio. I'm I'm taking a break in the Great Hall. Not if you now if you want to talk. So, very interesting. She seems to be the reward I get, somehow. Like, a, I'm assuming maybe a friend? I don't know. I'll have to find out. Oh, cool. Some frogs. So, convince Cheerio. Alright, so there's three comments. First, this person. Third year. Today is an Unmatching socks kind of day. Yeah, I don't care. Alright, who's that? Some guy. First year. There was nothing about having to survive werewolf attacks in the Hogwarts acceptance letter. Oh, and there's Marula. She's all alone because she's a lone wolf. And nobody likes her. Nobody cares about her. Marula. I think I know if if there was a werewolf at Hogwarts. Yeah, nobody cares. And there's um, Cheerios. Okay, she is pretty tiny, like a Cheerio. Cheerios, I'm glad I found you. Eh, uh, sorry, what's your name? I haven't introduced myself, have I? I'm Father Atkins. Oh, one since told me about... Tell me all about you. Nice to finally meet you now. Can I help you with something? You're investigating the werewolf attack on... On a student, right? How do you know? Obviously, <laughs> we. I talked to one cent, stupid. One cent told me you've been asking around about the attack. 
I'm investigating what happened too. You are? Why? I'm worried it might be someone. It might might somehow be related to the cursed vaults. I want to question the victim directly, but no one I talked to knew who she was. I was hoping you might know her name. I wish I did, but I don't. Sorry. Oh well. Since we're both investigating the same thing anyway, why don't we get to the bottom of what happens together? I don't know you. I mean, I know you don't know me well, but I think we can accomplish a lot more if we work together. Besides, this might have, might even be an opportunity to try to know each other and become friends. Hmm. I see what he's trying to do. So, what do you say? Thank you, Father. But no, to both the offer of help and friendship. Damn. I don't understand. Do you think I'm? I'll hold you back. Do you not? like me? Does my breath smell rotten? No, of course not. Actually, why are you so interested in investigating the werewolf attack anyway? You never said. I have my reasons. Tell me something. I mean, tell me something, father. Do you think the werewolf, the responsible werewolf responsible for the attack should be sent to Azkaban? They should. I weren't got that far. Yes, I'm quite sure she wants that answer. I wouldn't go as far as throwing the were werewolf in Azkaban, especially since we don't even know all the details of the attack. Does that, does the context of the attack really matter if a person got hurt? But we can save deciding what to do with the werewolf until after we figure out exactly what happened, which we can do quicker and safer if we team up. I don't know, Father. It's nothing personal, but. Investigating the werewolf attack is just something I think I'm better off doing on my own. Let's talk this over, Cheerios. I think you'll see how much better it'll be if we investigate it together. Okay, so I'm really eager to get her, I guess. Persuade Cheerios. Damn, 1919. 19, 19. Luckily, I have literally 1919. 19. So start. I have my reasons for wanting to investigate the attack alone. Why are you investigating? To uncover the truth, to protect Hogwarts, it's something to do. Hmm. <clears throat> uncover the truth, protect Hogwarts. I think it's uncover the truth, right? Oh, I, I had to... Oh, wow. I just say the other one. It's whatever. I do have seven turns. Damn, that little? What? Okay, great. I have to... I'm going to um, search the answers. I don't want to get them wrong. Okay. Um, trying to search. So, Hogwarts. Convince Chiria. Oh, Cheerios, whatever. Convince Char Cheerio to investigate together. There, there we go. Okay, I just need the answers, please. Wherever they are. Alright, why do you want to team up? Okay. Two heads are better than one. Awesome. Alright, plus 10, okay, 5 turns left. Why are you investigating? Did I just say that already? To protect Hogwarts, yeah. What? I guess to repeat the question, it's whatever I guess. What you're saying makes sense, but I still, I'm still not sure working together is a good idea. I understand, but let's keep talking, you might start to feel differently. <laughs> I can't handle, handle this on my own. Yes, but you don't have to. There we go. <clears throat> oh. Nice, I got the second diamond. Working together might be a smart thing to do, but I'm still a bit nervous. I'll do my best to help you feel more confident in the idea. You're better off without me. Um, I think I'm better off with you. 
Ooh. All right, let's see what she says. I'm just not sure about this. I'm just not. I could really use your help. Yep. And there. That should finish it. You're right, Father. Getting to the bottom of this rumor will be easier if we work together. That didn't take long to convince her. I got 10, uh, I think that's Chink's XP. I'm glad you, you've you decided to investigate the werewolf attack with me, Cheerios. Where should we start? I'd still, I'd still like to ask the girl who was attacked for more information. But if you don't know her name, I don't know where... I don't know where... Where? Wait, what? I don't know where going to find find her. Where, I guess, is supposed to say. If only we could look at Madame Pomfrey's patient files. If Madame Pomfrey treated a girl after a wolf werewolf attack, I'm sure her name should be in there. That's a brilliant idea, Cheerios. Don't... Don't get too excited. I already tried asking Madame Pomfrey if I could take a look and it didn't work. She wouldn't let me near them. But this time you have me and I have a plan. Meet me at the hospital wing, Cheerios. We're going to get the name of the attacked student together. Cool. So now we're going to break in inside the hospital wing, I'm assuming. Get the student's name. Now the time... Now the time to put your plan in place. Meet me at the hospital wing. Okay. The good thing I still have a bunch of energy. Get the student's name. So there she is. Oh, there's three people with comments. Let's see. Fifth year. I cast the curse of the bo boogies, bogies, I think bogies, on myself to get out of transfiguration. Okay, nobody cares. Fourth year. I thought I was lovesick. Turns out I was just regular sick. Yeah, whatever. Seventh year. My friend bet that I couldn't eat ten pumpkin p pasties, pasties in a minute. I ate twelve and promptly threw up all over Snape. Okay, that's funny. <laughs> she like moaned. Alright, Cheerios. How are we going to convince Madame Pomfrey to let us search through her patient files? Simple, we're not going to convince her. What? I'm going to distract Madame Pomfrey while you search for the name of the victim of the werewolf attack. I feel bad going behind Mad Madame Pomfrey's back. But if it'll let us get some answers about what actually happened, I'm in. Only how are you going to distract Madame Pomfrey? I'll flash her. <laughs> I've... I figured I'd faked an illness or injury. Why? Madame Pomfrey's been catching students pretending they're ill to get out of class for decades. She's not going to be easy to fool. Good point. Any suggestions? Most people get caught right away because they're either they either pick these outlandish landish illnesses that are easy to debunk. Or are so poor at faking symptoms that Madame Pomfrey can tell right away there's nothing actually wrong. I suggest you stick to a specific symptom. Come up with a believable story and sell it realistically. Madame Pomfrey, Pomfrey will eventually realize you're fine, of course. But if you're convincing, it will take <clears throat> it will take her long enough to examine you that I'll have time to look at her records. Got it, Cheerios. I think I'm ready to distract Madame Pomfrey. Wait, I'll come with you. Your story might be more convincing if I pack it up. Okay. So we're with Madame Pomfrey. Madame Pomfrey, I don't feel so well. I'm worried something's wrong. You appear normal. You ob you obvi no obvious plagues or rashes. What seems to be ailing you? Uh, my stomach hurts. My head hurts. I feel fatigued. Um, what sounds more believable? My stomach hurts? Hmm, no, my head hurts. I feel fatigued. I think that sounds a little better. I felt, 
I felt so tired of fatigued lady, and I'm not sure why. Did you say that you stay up all night listening to the Wizard Wireless Network, perhaps? <clears throat> no, in fact, I've been heading to bed early specifically because I thought I wasn't getting enough sleep. But no matter how much I get, and how much I get, it never seems to be enough. And you're sure you're not here to get a pass to sleep through class? Madam Palfrey, I'm tired of sleeping. The last thing I want to do is sleep more. Besides, I was the one who suggested Father visit you, Madam Palfrey. I'm worried Father's fatigue might be the beginnings of something serious like scrofungolus. Scrofung That's very possible. Perhaps I had better examine you, Father, just to be safe. Thank you for bringing Mr. Atkins here, Miss Lobowska. I can take it from here. Now lie down on the open bed and I'll take a more thorough look at you. Alright, so now what? Distract Pomfrey. Uh, is she still here? Oh yeah, she's right there. Okay, so Cheerios is ready. Also, isn't she, isn't she visible? She's like literally on Madame Pomfrey's eyesight. Right, so one hour. So let's see, uh, I'll start off with Whale. I'm not going to die, am I, Madame Pomfrey? Talk. I can assure you, you are not dying. Point at. Can I have a tissue, Madame Pomfrey? I'm far too weak to get one myself. <laughs> I think. I wonder if Cheerio been, Cheerio's been able to find the, oh my, I didn't get to read all of it. Divert attention. You're still considerably less needy than Professor Snape when he gets a cold. Act. Madam Parfum, is that you? I think my vision's fading. That's funny. Okay, um... Extract. I need you to hold still so I can check your vitals. Watch. Well. I'm not going to die. Okay, he said already. Watch. Talk. I'll watch. Oh, that's it. Okay, cool. Where is the thermometer? It's almost as if if someone vanished it. So, 25 coins, cool. I have examined you thoroughly and can say with certainty that you are fine. You don't seem to have scrofungalus or any active fever, but I'd still, I'd still take precautions just in case. That's a relief, Madam Pomfrey. Thank you for looking after me. Be sure to thank Miss Lobos Loboska as well for her diligence. I had no idea Cheerios was so knowledgeable about healing. Indeed, <laughs> what was that? Oh! Indeed, she's the most talented intern I have. Cheerio helps you here at the hospital wing? Yes, during her free periods, she wants to work at St. Mungo's Hospital one day. <laughs> Ah, she was. She has impeccable side matter, bedside manner, and always goes well out of her way to help patients. Once she even stayed up all night rubbing the back of a student affected by the slug vomiting, vomiting charm. It's rare to find such patients in a practicing healer because, Madam Pomfrey, I need a bucket. I think I'm going to be. Sit blah. Well, because of things like that, you're free to go unless you like to help me stay clean. I think I'll pass, Madam Pomfrey, but thank you again. Okay, so that was enough. Also, she was literally facing the direction of Cheerios. Cheerios, how did it go? Did you find the attacked student's file? Yes, her name is Pippa Macmillan. Millen? Mil million? Whatever. She's a third year Gryffindor. She was found leaving the Forbidden Forest with gashes on her arm and was treated, treated based on her claim that she had been attacked by a werewolf. It sounds like we have our confirmation that it's a werewolf. But her, perhaps more important, importantly, we have a name. Let's talk to people, Macmillan, Millen, whatever. 
she might be able to um, tell us more about more information including who the werewolf might be all right get the student's name complete question people damn it i did not get to read it i clicked on the screen by accident i'll read it when i add it i guess if i remember damn i'm still in part one great whatever at least i have a bunch of energy still question people Uh, ironically, she's all alone in the Trump's classroom. So there's Peepa. Peepa Macmillan? Yes, that's me. I'm Father Atkins and this is Cheerio Labosca. He hello. We're investigating what happened the night of, our, of your werewolf attack. Do you mind if we ask you a few questions? I don't know. I've already been asked about it plenty. I understand you're probably still shaking it from the attack, but if it's it's important we figure out exactly what happened. It's possible this might be related to the cursed vaults. If that's the case, then Hogwarts could be in danger. Any details you can tell us tell us might help us figure out who the werewolf is and prevent this from happening again. Your ability is to protect Hogwarts depends on the accuracy of my story. Is something the matter, Peepa? Are you still in pain? Should I fetch Madame Pomfrey? No, it's nothing like that. The truth is, I'm not 100% sure it was a werewolf that attacked me. You're not? But that's what you've been telling everyone. I thought it was. That's why I reported it as a werewolf attack to Madame Pomfrey. Everything I remember makes it seem like a werewolf, but it was dark. I was afraid and it happened so fast. I was going to just accept that, accept I'd been attacked by a werewolf, but then word got out and people started panicking. Now your investigation is depending on me being accurate, and suddenly I'm not so confident in my memories. Tell us everything you do remember, people. We'll see what we can make of it. So let's see how long. Three hours. Discuss the attack. Note. A big white creature longed at, longed at me from some underground. Or whatever I said. Growth. So this howl didn't, his how, this howl didn't uh, sound like, a, oh my goodness, I didn't get to read it. Whatever. Think about. Cheerio looks really uncomfortable. True. Listen. Maybe she's the wolf? I remember hearing a howl right before I was attacked. Ask question. So the white creature scratched you but didn't bite? Give advice. Don't let anyone make you feel embarrassed for being scared, people. Focus on. The creature you saw had white fur and howled? Also, also it does make sense for it to be Cheerios to, since she does have gray hair or white hair, whatever. Ponder. So th this howl didn't sound like a regular wolf's howl? Comfort. I'm a Gryffindor. I should have stayed to defend. I should have stayed to defend myself. I don't, okay, I didn't read the rest. Over here, I shouldn't have let myself get my hopes up. Um, follow along. The attack happened in the Forbidden Forest on the night of the full moon. Talk. I went into the far Forbidden Forest on a dare, needless to say, it didn't end well. Pay attention. Thankfully, I wasn't bitten, but I did get scratched while trying to run away. Think about. And there, I got all the stars. Cheerio looks really uncomfortable. Oh, wow. Alright, so 50 coins. A, bi a howl, a big white creature, and started and getting scratched. That's about all I'm sure I remember. I wish I could recall what I saw more clearly, clearly that night, but I ran away. That's all right, people. You were scared. It's only natural. But I'd say, based on what you've told us, it sounds like... Like people was attacked by a white werewolf, doesn't it, Father? It seems that way. We don't know that for sure. Um... Yeah, I guess so. The full moon, a howl, and a big creature. It certainly seems like she was attacked by a were werewolf. 
I'm relieved I wasn't mad for assuming I was a werewolf. That, that settles it. Settles what, Cheerios? I'm sorry, people, for everything you went through. Why are you apologizing? You didn't do anything. Da 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 da. Cheerio was wrong. He looked terrible, terrified. I've got to go. Okay, and she runs away. Is she alright? I don't think so. I better go and talk to Cheerios. Part one complete. Awesome. Got two gems. Wait, there's four parts. Oh yeah, there is. Okay, never mind. Lone Wolf Part Two. Cheerios reveals some surprise. Reveals some surprising new information that prompts you to work to jog people's memory. Okay. Question people. That's done. Talk to Cheerios. I'm sorry, fa I'm sorry, Father. I need to be alone right now. Damn, so I have to wait two hours. Great. Oh my goodness. And I have 102 energies left. Now what do I do? I didn't want to make the video that long. Um, Right now... I r the previous video was 39 minutes this one is go probably gonna be like more than 30 minutes as well should I come back I I obviously don't want to wait till tomorrow because I do have energy left from the um the pass oh I do have oh, oh I only have two whatever I'm still number one awesome I'm gonna try my best to be number one just stay number one Talk to Cheerios. Hmm. I guess I'll just continue with the story mode. Or should I save up for the... I don't know. I have... 3 days, 19 hours left. Yeah, I'll just continue with the story mode. And then, um... I don't know. Right now it's 8... PM eight oh six. I guess I could uh continue this later. Damn, it's gonna be it's gonna be a long video. Whatever. I'll I'll finish the uh, energy. So I'm gonna talk to Bill now. I thought I didn't have to wait, but I guess I have to. So there's Bill. He's practicing on some dummies. So I guess I'm going to continue with the story mode. Wabam. Whack. Did you get my owl? What owl? I thought I, I picked the option to talk to him, not send him an owl. Kaboom. What can I do for you, Father Atkins? You know who I am? Your brother was the talk of the Weasley household when the Daily Prophet printed his search for the cursed vaults. Rumor is you're following in his footsteps. It's true, I wanted to see if I could ask for your help. I might be able to help you. Tell me what you want what you want with the cursed vaults. To help my friends, to understand them, to find my brother. Hmm to help my friends. How is that going to help uh, my friends understand them to find my brother? Sure, why not? My brother was obsessed with the vaults and disappeared. I'm hoping something inside gives me a clue to what happened. I'll help you, father. You will? Of course. This cursed ice is a danger to all of Hogwarts and breaking a cursed vault might stop the ice. Besides, I've never been on a curse-breaking adventure before. That's amazing, Bill. Thank you. Don't thank me yet. I, it will take hard work and even a little pain to prepare to cur to break a cursed vault. Practice your spells in class, and I'll train you to duel. After that, we'll break the curse on this vault together. All right. So talk to Bill is done. Practice transfiguration. If you want to break the curse on the vault, you'll have to prepare. It's time to get started. Okay. Also, what is that? Have like a memory or something. 
Um, not quite sure what it is. Nope. Okay, maybe here. Is it an adventure? I don't know. Oh my goodness, what is it? Is it a memory? The exclamation mark keeps on coming up. Not sure why. Um, finding Ben 10, yeah, I don't care. I don't think it's any of these, first duel. Oh, okay, that should have been it. Yeah, there we go, finally, it's gone. Practice transfiguration, complete study sessions to unlock. Damn, so I have to do that many? Spongify class. So, uh, that's all I have to do, practice transfiguration, yeah, okay, so I'm gonna do that, I guess. So, I have to do a full class, I'm assuming, and get nine stars. I need to practice my spellcasting to prepare for the Cursed Vault. Yep, so I have to do a class. Oh, cool, one hour, transfiguration class. Okay, lecture. I have prepared a lecture to discuss this impact important topic. Please listen carefully. Read board. And I'm, oh my goodness. Wow, I did not get to read it. Whatever. 10 empathy. And now let me see if you have been paying attention. Answer question. Which of these is not a form of transfiguration? Enchantments, I remember that. I've done this class before multiple times, so I kind of remember some of the answers. Sometimes I still answer them wrong by accident, but whatever. Demonstration. Please take your seats, students. It is time to begin your transfiguration transfiguration lesson. Okay. Oh, there's the cauldron as a cat. That's pretty cute. Alright, read board. It says consider the frog. What? Check index. I should look up all the words I don't know. Listen. Pay close attention. Oh wow, never mind, I didn't get to read it. Ooh, 40 empathy. Cool. Ahem, students, please watch me, please. I will demonstrate proper technique. This is the most important part, so please pay extra close attention. Focus. There we go. That was easy. And now she's smiling at me. Alright, so what's next? Study. Please review the book and your notes for today's lesson. Okay, look. Have you ever read a wizard novel? No, and I don't care. Uh, I can only click on her, I guess. Avoid. I hope she doesn't catch me. I thought I said she doesn't touch me, but whatever. Um, I cannot click on it. Okay, I found it. Doodle. What are you drawing? Okay, uh, 25 coins. There. It's so obvious. I have nothing left on my side of my of the desk. Study transfiguration alphabet. I like everyone to come up front and see closely what I have written on the blackboard. All right, be thoughtful. Your brother used to have the same look on his face in my class. Okay, I'll go with listen. I will not abide any of my students being cal cavalier with magic. Watch carefully, examine. Listen to me now, students. Oh, wow. 
I didn't get to read it. Um, 15 empathy. Are you following this, students? Please pay very close attention. Focus. Nice, I got it. Brilliant. Of course I am. Please don't look at me that way. Alright, what's next? Hone skills. What's up, students? I want you on your feet for this part of the lesson. Train. I'm never going to stop training. Let's see, examine. I'd rather examine. Examine. I wish I could memorize all the Transfiguration textbooks. Okay, listen. It feels so good. Okay, I didn't read all of it. Um, 15, knowledge. And there. To apply your wand power perfectly, you must have total concentration. Focus. There we go. I like the focus mini game. It's quite easy. And she's happy with me because I'm nice like that. So there, I completed it. Unlocks a spongify lesson. Also, I have to unlock it. Cool, I got some knowledge and house points. Nice. I think my spell casting has improved. I'm almost ready to return to the cursed vault. Okay. Oh wow, now I have to wait eight hours. Dual bill. Using magic in class is one thing. Using magic in a duel, that requires real skill. Get ready, I will test you shortly. Yeah, of course, I have to wait very long. What can I do in the meantime? Study session trans transfiguration class. Yes, so I could be get to spongify. Okay, sounds good to me. Oh, okay, so I guess I have to do it. Um, I guess I'll do that off camera. Otherwise, it's gonna take too long. The video. What is this? Oh, cool. I could get him as a little black mouse. Well, half black, half white. Oh, there's another. Um, there's a new dog. Um, a white dog with like black eyes or whatever. I should get a new pet actually. Let me see. Hmm, I, w I really want to get the chameleon or the lizard, whatever it is, but I don't have enough yet. I'll save up for it. I could get the frog, but no. I would like to get the, the owl, but I do want to get the lizard the most. I'm just not able to yet. Whatever. How about a cat, a different cat? Ooh, I could use 30 for the black cat. The other ones are mostly gems. Yeah, I'll, I'll just save up everything. Have I completed one? No, I haven't. Yeah, so I cannot really continue with anything else. I still have to wait an hour and 46 minutes for to continue the event with Cheerio. And then for Duel with Bill, I have to wait eight hours, so that's gonna be for tomorrow. If I get to even continue the story mode, because I'm gonna be focusing on the event the most. But yeah, I'll do the study sessions off camera so that I don't have to make the video that long. So um, I will be back within an hour and 46 minutes to continue with the event. So I'll be back then. Now to continue. So it's been two hours, more than two hours. So I'm able to continue with the event. Also, I was doing the study sessions to complete the spongify thing. And I ended up getting 35 energies from my shinks. I was gonna wait a little longer to continue once I got 28 energy, but since I ended up getting the 35 energy, I'm gonna continue now. So, talk to Cheerios.
in a training ground. Um, there it is. So let's see what she has to say. I'm assuming she's a wolf. Also, what is that little dog over there? Is that her little dog? So there's Cheerio. Father, what are you doing here? Checking on you. You left so quickly after people told us about her supposed wo werewolf attack. <laughs> and you were worried about me? Of course, who wouldn't be after seeing their friend so obviously upset? Friend? Father, we talked about mm. this. You don't want a friend like me. That's not true. If you say so, it's the other way around. What do you mean? What does that mean? It's the other way around. You don't want a friend like me. Oh, okay. So I mean, trying to say I do want a friend like her, I'm assuming. You don't want a friend like me. That's not true. If you say so, it's the other way around. Yeah, I actually don't understand it. What does it mean by it's the other way around? Because it already has the that's not true. So isn't it, isn't, it, isn't that saying the same thing? Both of them? That's not true. It's the other way around. Um, you say so, it's the other way around. That's not true. I'll go with that's not true. That's not true, Cheerio. I'd be lucky to have you as a friend. Only because you don't know any better. You don't know what I've done. You don't know that. Just tell me and you'll see. I can't. Can you at least tell me why you ran out, of, out on people and me? Hearing about a possible werewolf attack is scary, but you looked terrified. Almost like the werewolf was right in front of you. Almost. What's going on, Shirio? Are you alright? Is there something you know that I don't? I... I am the werewolf. <laughs> oh, look at the little werewolf. Boof, boof. Sorry, little dog. Now's not a good time. Get out of your stupid dog. Whimper. Whimper. Mm. Whatever. Boof isn't, isn't a dog. It's a werewolf pup who visits me from time to time. So he attacked. That's a werewolf? Yes, when werewolves mate on the full moon, they can have regular look looking wolf cubs. Mm. I know it sounds hard to believe, but it's true. Borf, Borf, Borf. Mm -hmm. Stupid dog. I think Borf likes you, father. Perhaps you should... You, you should too should... What? Go and... Okay, I think they added two shoulds by accident. Perhaps you too should go and play. There we go. Perhaps some other time. Right now I'm only worried about you and the werewolf attack. Look, Cheerio. Madam Pomfrey told me you give you give your all for the ill and injured students in the hospital wing. Perhaps it's time you let someone else you what what did he said? Help you instead, I think. Borf, Borf. It sounds like Borf agrees with you, Father. But I can't help you until you tell me what's wrong. You have seemed genuinely concerned for me, and it might help the investiga investigation for you to know. Plus, Borf does trust you, and he's a good judge of character. All right, fa Father. I'll tell you what I've been hiding. Starting with the fact that I'm a werewolf. <laughs> I can do knew it. You're a werewolf? That's right, and there's more I need to tell you. I'm, <laughs> I'm also serial. I thought you might hate me afterwards. Since she's Cheerios, she's also serial. Alright, so one hour. Talk to Cheerio. Oh look, the little puppy. Or oh, werewolf puppy, what, I guess, whatever. Console. The idea that I hurt someone is in my werewolf form is devastating. Comfort. I vowed I never hurt someone again and yet discuss. Borf's been trying to cheer me up, but mention. 
Porf usually stays with me when I transform, but not that night. Discuss. Porf's been trying to cheer me up, but... Uh, confirm. Note. It's odd I don't remember attacking people. Werewolves usually recall everything. Mention. Porf usually stays with me when... Okay. So you said that already? Listen. I think I'm the werewolf who attacked people as full moon. Console. Oh, there, I got, I got all the stars. The idea that I hurt someone in my werewolf form is devastating. Alright, so 25 coins. You suspect you're the werewolf who attacked people? I don't remember doing it, which is odd as werewolves typically remember everything when they transform. But I did lose control that night and the idea that I hurt someone terrifies me. I'm not worried about what happens to me, I can handle the repercussions. But poor people got hurt and perhaps even traumatized because of me. Cheerio. You probably think I'm a monster and I wouldn't blame you. That's not true at all, Cheerio. I'm not even sure you are responsible for the attack. I wish that was true, Father, but all the evidence points to me. People was full attacked on a full moon, which while I was transformed. She saw a big white creature who howled and my werewolf form form has white has white fur. I wasn't able to control myself which would explain why how people got scratched. Yes, but what about the fact that you don't remember attacking people at all even though you should? It's possible I forgot or blacked out. But you're not black. But it's just as possible that it wasn't you or any other werewolf for that matter that attacked people. Think about it. People said she only thought it was a werewolf. Still, it sounds like the only way we'll, we'll find out for sure is to improve people's foggy memory. How are we going to do that? How are you? Okay. Good question. Let's do a little research on magic related to memory and the Great Hall. And we'll see what we can come up with. Alright, talk to Cheerio. It's done. Research memory magic. I'm stocked up on books and ready to research memory magic in the great hall. Alright, so let's see what she has to say. Research memory magic. Interesting. Alright, there's some comments. Oh, there's one cent. I'll do her last. Uh, oh great, the girl I hate the most, the one that doesn't bend over to get her books. Fourth year. I'm hungry, but uh, nothing sounds good, so I, I suppose I'll just starve. Yes, die. Alright, fifth year. Just because I have fleas doesn't mean I'm a werewolf. Um, you're just dirty, that's it. One cent. I'm glad you worked, you're working with Cheerio. Alright, where's Cheerio? There she is. She's all alone with a bunch of books. She's thinking, I'm assuming. I brought every book on memory that I could find. Great, one of these has to contain a spell or potion that will cl clear up people's fussy memory of the attack. Then we'll finally be able to get a clear answer on what happened last full moon. And hopefully clear your conscience. Or confirm I'm guilty. Perhaps this isn't such a perhaps this isn't this isn't such a great idea after all. I know it's hard, but try not to think that way, Cheerio. You know you don't have to do all this for me, father. You're right, I don't have to, but I want to. I knew he was gonna say that. I just don't want to give you the wrong idea. I'm grateful for your help, but I still think it's better if you don't get too close. Especially since we don't know if I'm responsible for people's attack. Not yet, but hopefully something in these books will help us change that. Now come on, let's start researching. So let's see how long. Three hours. Hopefully I have enough energy. Uh, let's start off with reassert. We are sure. I'm starting to wonder if I really want to know what happened. Flip through. Sorry, I think Porf chewed a bit of that book. Joke. I wish I'd had a memory potion during my last exam. 
Research. This memory potion sounds promising. Consider. Get that. Flip through. Consider. We don't want to do anything to perma permanently affect people's memory. Preference text. Flip through. Sorry, I think. Oh, she actually said it already. Never mind. Research. Perf reference text. It take a memory charm to t make me forget. Um, I don't know what he said. Get that. I know how to make people forget, but I not remember. Discuss options. Oh, I ran out of, out of energy. Great. Okay, how do I get energy? Do I have anything there? No. Oh, I haven't gotten any of the marks anymore. I'm still in first place, at least. Anyways, um, wake up Catspur. I gotta look for energy everywhere. Dice should be there. Yeah, he's sleeping as well. Good. Alright, let's check the clubhouses. Uh, nothing yet. So none of them is gonna have anything. Alright. The orange is already. Let's check if the puppy is there. The wolf puppy. Nope. Okay, I did that earlier. Pinker spell is working hard and preparing for the next task. Pinker spells proved to be a par to be popular with customers and will help attract new customers to the event. All right. Can I feed? Uh, yeah, I can feed both truckle. The others are in 17 minutes. So both truckle first. He does seem. Uh, seem hungry since he's very skinny. Alright. Now to continue looking for energy. Alright, these towers. Let's see. The porch is not ready. Pet peeve is. Alright, let's see. How about the books? Yes, awesome. Maybe the stick is there. Yes, it is. All right. And now for the dungeons to hopefully see Dobby. Nope, not yet. How about a duel? Neither. Um, can I have a meal with someone? No, not yet. Well, actually, I'm doing a task, so obviously not. Gobstones is not ready either. All right, I have. I only got six energy. Great. Ah, I just remembered I left the kettle on. Okay, ponder. Why is it that the memories you want to forget are always the ones that stick? Who knows, talk. Professor Snape says that some t sometimes I have the memory of a plimpy. What's a plimpy? Okay, I, I need two more stars. Great, so I guess I'll have to come back later. I was hoping not to, but... What what can I do? I really don't have anything else. Ooh, I could collect this. Okay. This one is having a meal. Collect energy from the stick two times. What stick? Whatever. Wick your pets three times. Okay. From any creature. Buy any customization items. I could do that. I do have 3,000, but um, I guess I should save up a bit. I'll buy something cheap. Uh, not one of those. Yeah, the, like these are very cheap. I'll buy the 150 ones. I'm not gonna ever use them, but just to whatchamacallit where are they? there they are just to complete the full marks yeah there we go that's one of them nice win three duels in the dueling room I guess I still have to do that whatever at least I'm still in first place but yeah anyways I'll be back within 
Do I have energy? Yes, I do. Okay, let me just use it quickly. There. So now I'll be back within like maybe two hours whenever I have enough energy, I guess. Alright, now to continue. Research ma memory magic. Reassure. I'm starting to wonder if I really want to know what happened. Joke. I'd wish I wish I'd had a memory potion during my last exam. Research that's five. Come on, click. There we go. Consider. We don't have to do anything to permanently affect people's memory. Reference text. It take a memory charm to make me forget this blasted jingle. Ponder. Why is it that 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 the memories you want to forget are always the ones that stick? Get the thoughts. And there I got all the stars. I know what to make people forget but not remember. Alright, 50 coins and a chocolate frog. Apparently memory potions improve the clarity of the drinker's memories. If we have people drink this, I'm sure it'll, it'll allow her to remember the night of the full moon more clearly. Then we should be able to prove whether or not you're the one that attacked people. Right. What's wrong, Cheerio? Are you still doubting that this is a good idea? It's just, what if we do this and I don't like the answer I get? What do I do then? That won't happen. You'll make it right. You'll have to accept it. Hmm. I guess she could take back her scratch. Uh, somehow. You'll have to accept it. You'll make it right. Then you'll do everything you can to make it right and ensure it never happens again. Once you do, I'm sure you'll be able to forgive yourself. How could I ever make up for literally and figuratively scarring someone? I'm not sure, but you'll definitely find a way, because that's the sort of person you are. She, he, he, I don't even know her that well. Anyways. I suspect you think too highly of me, father. But your confidence in me makes me feel like it just might be possible. Thank you, Father, for... I'm feeling a bit more comfortable giving people a memory potion now. Now we just need to brew one. Where do we start? I wish I knew. The recipe wasn't in the book. But I bet Snape knows. Why don't we ask him? Oh, great. Alright, but please don't tell him what we need it for. I don't want Professor Snape to find out that I might be behind a werewolf attack. Don't worry, Cheerio. I'll be sure to be discreet, 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 yeah, discreet when we ask Snape how to brew a memory potion. So I guess it's, he's next. Learn memory potions. If you must interrupt my work, come to the potions classroom and do it now. All right. Uh, first, what is this? Oh, I'm um, able to feed Sniffler and Belly Boat. So I'm going to do that. Also, I'm going to end the video after this. I'm not going to continue with the uh, Snape thing. I'll do that tomorrow because it's, it's already 12 a.m. 12, 16 a.m. 17 now. So I'll continue tomorrow for sure. Oh, right, I have to go to Billy Boat now. He must be starmi starving. Look at him, he looks very skinny. Uh, one little tiny piece of food is what he gets. Um, 15 empathy. There we go. Alright. Thank you, Sniffler. I'll sniff you later. I've been forgetting to say that. Alright, chocolate frogs. I got one. Nice. Hmm. So learn memory potions. That's um part two, task three out of five. So I should be able to complete it tomorrow and then I'll go continue to part three. 
I still don't understand. Part 4, the, the reward is Cheerio? Like, do I get a doll size of her? Or like a little doll that looks like her or something like that? Or does she, is she like, do I st end up being able to play her or something like that? I don't know. I kind of don't get it. Or maybe I unlock her as a friend or something like that. Or maybe something more than friends. Anyways, oh wow, I haven't really completed much here. The boost still is active for 12 hours and 58 minutes, basically 13 minute hours. There's nothing here, yeah, nothing. And I already got this, so. So well, what was I gonna go to? Let me just go talk to Snape. At least I'll... Oh, there's no Dobby. But anyways, learn memory potions. It's not going to start anyways, so it's alright. Oh, he's alone. I thought I was going to be the, like a class. So there's me and Cheerios. To what do I owe this disruption of my work? Professor Snape, we were hoping you could teach us how to brew a memory potion. Of course, let me drop everything I'm doing and we'll get started straight <laughs> straight away. He's being sarcastic, that's why it's funny. That would be great, thank you. Wait, you're being sarcastic, aren't you? <laughs> you really must learn to be less gullible, Laboska, or someone's bound to take advantage of you. Please, Professor Snape, we weren't asked if it wasn't important. Important? I'll be the judge of that. Why do you Why do you need to learn how to brew a memory potion? To remember, <laughs> to remember mom's birthday? That's actually funny. To remember my brother? To remember the homework? That's a bad answer, to remember the homework. To remember mom's birthday? That sounds so stupid. But I mean, I get it. To remember my brother. Hmm. Yeah, that sounds a little better, I guess. Let's see. My my old memories of my brother are starting to fade and I don't want to lose them. Until I find him, those memories are all I have left Aww. of him. Surely you must appreciate how precious the memories you created with your loved ones are, right, Professor? Aww. He doesn't have family. <laughs> Very well. I'll teach you how to brew a memory potion, but you'll have to do all the brewing on your own. And let's see how does the how long does the last? It lasts three hours. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna continue it right now. I will continue it tomorrow. I should be able to finish it and then continue um, the last task for part two and then continue to do part three. But yeah, that's it for now. It was quite fun. But the video is going to be quite long. Like two hours or so. Since I did uh, do a bunch of stuff. Especially since I got a bunch of energy from the the um, premium rewards. But yeah, anyways, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Comment down below what you guys think. And I'll see you guys in the next Harry Potter Hogwarts mystery video.